Yes, yes, this I do. <laughs> hmm? Huh? Shut your bitch ass! Partner creators, they're everywhere, just like the amount of kids in Sheen Factories. Love them or hate them, they're all chasing one thing. Them sweet, sweet tokens. I feel like because these people are making bang from this concept, more players are turning into those greedy little goblins who are trying to chase a bag. The funny thing is, they're running out of things to turn into games, of which they're accusing a different creator who is doing the exact same thing of copying them. The gold items are supposed to be held by creators that make games that aren't total wastelands, but now random people are getting them which doesn't make the other people who got them before feel special. Now hold up, not all creators are like this, but my research shows that Six of every ten creators are cash grabbers, which means that 20% of a thousand people turn into cash grabbers. I've came across a ton of these people, which they ask me what a smuck is an insult. That good bro. Bruh. People who played Wreckerm and actually have a brain note that these games are dog sh and should be wiped off the platform. So to prove it, I asked three of my friends to give me their honest opinions. What is your honest opinion about the partner creators who make all the shitty games? They need to go. I honestly think that they're like just making the games because I don't know they want to make them <laughs> shit do you think that most creators do it just to flex on other people I think so um not really I just I just think that they're making it because some of those games are kind of like funny at some points yeah most creators most of these creators are young they don't uh, really care about the money as much so I think it's mostly for the clout, yes. Should Wrecker do something about it? Yes, there are so many copies of the same exact games, kind of like the costume hangouts. Maybe like if they're doing bad stuff in it, like, like inappropriate things. Yes, yes, I've been advocating for this for about, ever. Okay. Yes, Rec Room should do. In this case, two out of three said that these games should not be allowed on Rec Room. And I think that the creators who make these games and then private them should lose their partnership. This is a cry for a solution. Please, Rec Room, save us. I want to wake up one day and see no Ignited Catnap game on the hot page. Who the fuck is Ignited Catnap, bruh? Anyways, creators big head, they just see you as a fucking doll in their wallet, of which most of them have millions of tokens that don't do anything with them. Lamar Jackson, if you can hear us, please save us, Lamar Jackson.